Recent carjackings by teenagers in Chattanooga have raised the alarm bells of law enforcement and the community. Hamilton County District Attorney Cody Womp came out today to express her concerns about these incidents. News 12's Nick Hill was able to learn what she believes residents should do to keep their cars and other possessions safe. And one of the reasons that we're making this announcement today and treating it very serious is that I felt like if we didn't do it sooner than later, what's going to happen next week and the next week? District Attorney Womp announced today at a press conference actions her office is taking in the wake of two carjackings allegedly perpetrated by minors. The incidents she is referring to include carjackings on DeSales Avenue near Memorial Hospital and Roanoke Avenue in the past week. Both carjackings, according to Chattanooga Police, were committed by juveniles, all from 13 to 16 years old. District Attorney Wapp says her office is looking to transfer five of these six defendants to be charged as adults for charges of aggravated robbery and a carjacking, both Class B felonies in Tennessee. The 13-year-old suspect, according to Wamp, is too young to be tried as an adult in Tennessee on these statutes. We are in a place in Hamilton County where we have got to hold juveniles accountable. Um, and unfortunately, some are just going to have to be the example. She wants the public to be aware of why many of these crimes are taking place. She said that 386 firearms were stolen last year, the vast majority of them inside of unlocked vehicles. Your, your vehicle is not, a, is not a gun safe, and it shouldn't be treated as such. It sh you should not leave a firearm, the public should not leave a firearm in a vehicle locked or unlocked basically ever. She explained how focused some can be in their search for firearms. Often, they're siphling through vehicles not looking for anything but a firearm. In fact, based on personal experience, they'll leave sunglasses and they'll leave bags that have valuables in them. She says during this time, those in Hamilton County need to be on high guard. When I talk to my friends and family um, about, you know, especially in certain parts of town, uh, if you get out of your car at a gas station, you need to feel different about it now than you did 10 years ago. In Chattanooga, Nick Hill, News 12.